the bottom of a European pond is a strange place to find a fertility aid. But then, a freshwater mussel is the perfect reproductive accessory for a fish called the bitterling. That's because this male uses the shellfish as a partner to help lure a female. He dances around it, getting it used to his presence so that it doesn't automatically close up its shell when he gets too close. Then the fish dances to attract a female, but she's only got eyes for his muscle. She's careful to choose a shellfish that filters lots of water, because a well-ventilated mussel is important when you want to use it as a nursery. She uses that long tube to deposit her eggs inside the mussel. The male follows close behind and fertilizes them. The bitterling uses the mussel as a high-security incubator. The shellfish maintains a steady flow of well-oxygenated water for the fish's eggs to develop in. After about two weeks inside their strange nursery, hundreds of baby bitterlings leave home. Relationship between the bitterling and the mussel is far less compassionate. The clam doesn't really get involved in the relationship. The bitterling does most of the work and gains all the rewards.